Hey guys, and welcome back for another tutorial. Today I'm going to be doing my second installment in my spring pen series. And today I'm going to be working on this ladybug pen. Um, this is a very simple pen and great for beginners. So yeah, let's get straight into it. Um, the things that you will need are red and black clay and a little bit of white. And a rolling pen, a straight blade, a ball tool and some glaze if you wish to make it nice and shiny. So the first thing I did was I took my red clay and I rolled it out into a flat sheet and I rolled it out to be um, long and short so it's going to be wrapping around the pen and then I took my black clay and I also rolled it flat. I also rolled it to be the same length as the red because I'm going to be cutting a long strip and that will go um, vertical on the pen and then I also have a piece that will be going horizontal on the pen. So here I am cutting the stripe. And then I am going to get my red clay and Cut off some of the red because I'm going to be placing some black there and then clean up the one side of the red to make it nice and flat. So now I'm cleaning up both the black and the red edges and I cut down the black to make it a stripe and I'm going to add my vertical stripe onto the one side. And then I'm going to get my pen. I'm using a Bic pen and these pens are great for baking. They will not melt in your oven. Um, they could potentially, but um, if you have it in for 15 to 20 minutes and it should be completely fine. So I'm just wrapping the clay around the pen and I'm going to roll it a little bit and create a little indent and cut that straight line and then continue rolling the pen to cover it completely with the clay and then I will pinch it with my fingers and smooth it out and make sure that there are no cracks or air bubbles or and then I just close up the end there. And now I'm just using my straight blade to finish the edge near the ink. Make it nice and clean. And now I'm going to roll another sheet of black clay and I'm going to use a circle cookie cutter. I have a little Kemper style cutter that I got from eBay or Amazon and I just cut out a bunch of circles. Um, if you don't have a little circle cookie cutter you can always take balls of black clay and then just flatten them right onto the pen and that'll give you a nice perfect circle too. So I'm just going to take the black circles and place them randomly throughout the red clay. And then that's pretty much it for the majority of the pen. Now I'm just going to take some white clay to create the face. Normally I would do a black face, but of course you will not be able to see the black face on a black backdrop. So I just rolled out some white and then afterwards I actually took some black paint and put little dots in the middle of the white to make them have little irises. So I'm just, I planned it up with my little ball tool and then I placed little balls into those little divots and then I just pushed them in with the end of my ball tool and then used a little tiny thin snake to create a mouth. So then after that I just baked it in my oven for 15 minutes or so and I glazed it up with my triple thick from Americana and that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you did give me a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe and share. I also have a, two other links that you will find at the end of this video. That'll be my other two pens that will be in this little pen series. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.